Update 8.0 is one of the largest in World of Tanks Blitz. It includes a new tank branch, new graphics quality and effects for tanks, dynamic suspension and balance changes. And now for the details. New tanks have arrived in the game. They are based on concepts created in 1953 by the HL Yo Company for a US Army research program. This branch of American heavies starts at Tier 7 with the M7 Yo. It's a dynamic heavy tank with decent turret armor and a comfortable 105mm standard gun that makes it perfect for your first experience commanding Yo's. At Tier 8, you'll find the M3 Yo. It also has a strong turret and good dynamics. But most importantly, it features a magazine-based gun with three shells. Considering its good depression and elevation angles, this tank can cause a lot of trouble for enemies. At Tier 9, there's the M5 Yo. This Yo definitely has the weirdest look of the branch, but its turret is quite good at deflecting shells, and the most interesting features of the new American vehicles start with this tank. It offers two magazine-based guns to choose from. The first has three shells, but the second is a perfect example of what makes Yo's so peculiar. It has two shells and an extremely fast reload time between shots. Moreover, this Yo features another unique mechanic, an emergency track. Even with a damaged track, you can roll backwards. You can get to cover and survive even if your repair kit is cooling down. The crown jewel of the new branch is the M6 Yo. It has the emergency track just like its predecessor, as well as two different top guns. The choice depends on your preference. The three-shooter is more accurate and provides better penetration, while the two-shooter deals more damage and reloads faster between shots. Also, this tank has a solid turret, but there are some vulnerable spots, like the commander's hatches. Take advantage of the terrain, use cover wisely, don't stop moving, and maximize the drum's effectiveness. You can learn more about this branch from our special video and the dedicated article about the Yo's. Let's move on. Update 8.0 increases the graphics quality of tank models. Materials and light will be more realistically displayed on the tank, making images livelier and brighter. The first tanks featuring updated graphics will be the new Yo's. The game will also feature mud accumulation and soaking effects. Over the course of the battle, your tank will be covered in dirt, sand or snow. Its metal will get wet from water and dry out once it's in the sun. Looking good! In the future, even the game's oldest tanks will boast new 3D models and effects. Another new feature in this update is dynamic suspension. The track driving and adjusting wheels, support and lower rollers, road arms or carts and other parts of the suspension will act as realistically as possible. The suspension's movement will adjust to the terrain. The track's tension and sag will depend on the suspension's construction. And after a jump, the suspension will cushion the tank's landing, while also adding a greater sense of how heavy a vehicle is. Unlike the soaking and mud accumulation effects, dynamic suspension will work for all tanks after the update releases. Update 8.0 will also introduce a number of balance changes for some tanks. For example, the armor of the T-32, T-28, BDR G-1B, Churchill gun carrier and Centurion Mark I was changed. The lower glassy plate of the T-28 was made weaker, but the tank will become thicker in other places. The BDR G-1B lost a few millimeters of turret armor. The others will receive improved armor. The T-25-2 and Pershing receive a slight increase in reload time, and the penetration of the guns for the T-44-100 and T-44 was increased. Moreover, the T-44-100 received 40 more horsepower. Slight changes were made to the interface, Special icons appeared in the camo section. They now clearly indicate which camos require certificates. That's all for now. Update 8.0 is an important milestone for World of Tanks Blitz, and we're not going to stop. Subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on everything important happening in the world of mobile tanks.